Behind me lies a feast, which doesn't look too nice, to be honest. We've got raw meat, we've got mushroom stew, and a piece of kelp. Doesn't look too tasty to me, but to complete this game, we gotta eat them. Well, I don't have to eat them. My Minecraft character does. I was gonna put out a banquet here of all the foods that I need to eat to complete an advancement, which is this one right here, a balanced diet. Eat everything that's edible, even if it's not good for you. Wait, we have 11 left? How do we have 11 left? Anyway, we're gonna try and work through that first, and then we're gonna take on another one of the advancements, because if you haven't seen the series before, for whatever reason, go watch it all from beginning to end right now. Okay, I'm kidding. <laughs> we are really close to completing Minecraft in hardcore mode, and the achievement that I wanna try out today is rescuing a ghast from the nether, bringing it safely home to the overworld, and then after all of that, you just have to kill it. I mean, that's gonna be ridiculously hard, but I hope Lucky Boy will be able to help me out here to... Really in a gust. It's gonna be really difficult, but we're gonna try it anyway. So where should we start? We need to just start eating things. I've got the list on the left. We've got apple, baked potato. We kind of started on this last time. Uh, let's just start by eating some of these. We've got the mutton right here. Don't know if I've eaten this, to be honest with you, but I need to get some hunger in my belly so that I can actually eat these things. Then we need to, I think we need to roast this. Oh, I've got cooked salmon as well, just in case. But yeah, I need to cook up the kelp so it turns to dried kelp so we can eat it. Rabbit and then mushroom stew we definitely haven't eaten so let me do the mushroom stew first big noms didn't mean to do that i wonder how many of the fireworks i have wasted by doing that <laughs> it's got to be quite a lot did that work was that one of them yeah, 28, 38. Sweet. We've got 10 left. Okay, cooked rabbit is up next. We do have to eat uncooked rabbit as well, which is a little bit terrifying. We're going to do the boring ones first, and then we're going to move on to the more interesting advancements. Last time, we resummoned the ender dragon, which was pretty fun. Didn't realize it would be so easy, though. I didn't know that the ender dragon was just the same ender dragon again. I thought it was going to be, like, buffed up. It'll have more iron bars around all of his end crystals. None of that happened. So I'm just going to get real hungry, and then I'm going to eat as much as... As I can eat away my sorrows. Oh, and by the way, we might need an egg as well. So while I run around trying to get some more hunger, why don't we visit this? What I was going to use for my <laughs> for my wither um pen. Oh, you know what? He's got an egg. You have been blessed. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh no, I was meant to I was meant to right click. Oh, that's really embarrassing. Oh no. Um, you know what? Guys, I'm out of here. This was not my fault. You can all be free, actually. I don't need you anymore. I've got the eggs that I need. I've just spotted another one. So you guys can be free. I didn't need you, actually. Right, let's <laughs> This is so awkward. Let's eat uncooked rabbit first, which is gross. There we go. And then we'll eat the cooked rabbit real fast. Now we should be on 32. We've eaten both of those already, apparently. Like, wh what? How? Now we need to get hungry again. Maybe I haven't eaten raw chicken. This is like a big guess. I have no idea what's going on. My kelp should be ready now, too. Oh, look how tasty that looks. My goodness. How could I resist? Nom nom. That was disgusting. I'm very quick, actually. <laughs> Why was it so quick? Yeah, 29. Is this 30? There yeah, it is as well. 30. So I need to look at the raw things that I haven't eaten yet. And then we're going to go for cooked salmon as well. Going to eat that bad boy. 31. Okay, we've got seven left. You know what I do need? I need pumpkin pie. One of you guys better serve me pumpkin pie. I'm pretty sure you can buy it. Or we could just make it. Which is the easiest one to do? Give me your trades. Come here. Hey, you. You have, yeah, pumpkin pie. One emerald. I will take one set. Thank you very much, my friend. Goodbye, buddy. Well, that was easy. Pumpkin pie solved. So my strategy to eat raw flesh should work. Okay, never mind. I didn't get the negative effect. <laughs> I was gonna eat it, so it gives me hunger, and then it doesn't give me hunger. Fantastic. There we go. That's better. So it gives me hunger for 30 seconds, and if I jump around at the same time, that should make it come down quite a bit, right? That's the idea. I mean, it kind of works. It doesn't give you that much hunger, and when you eat rotten flesh, it gives you two back. So this isn't the best course of action. So I'm gonna do this, and then I'm gonna eat... One pumpkin pie. Big noms. What are we on now? 32. Six left. What could possibly be left? I just thought of another thing I need to buy as well. I need cookies. I have a feeling we bought them before, but I'm not sure. So I'm going to buy those as well. Cookies are needed for this banquet. Come here, sir. Oh, I fell in. Oh, that was not helpful. Three for 18 cookies. I'll take them. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I've done this before. I also don't have a hoe on me because I broke it last time. Sorry, buddy. I didn't mean to do that. That was my bad. Maybe we didn't do rabbit stew last time. I feel like we made this already. I'm not too sure, though. Let's just take it and eat it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Tasty, tasty. 32. <laughs> 
I did do it last time. My brain. We do also need a poisonous potato, which is slightly random, but definitely needs to be done. I also need some raw beef. Sorry, fellas. I did come and um, get some of your leather off camera. So I did kill some, but I did also breed some. So don't make me feel too bad. Who is the chosen one? It's you. Actually, it was, it was a few of you. I'm sorry. <laughs> You know what? While we're getting hungry, let's do and start initiating the plan for the ghasts. So we need obsidian. Luckily, we have an absolute ton of it. Right, we're going to go to the nether. And I think the only way to do this is to build a massive nether portal and then try and get the ghasts through it. I think that's the only way that we can do it because you can build as big of a nether portal as you like. Well, to a, to a certain extent, but we can build a massive one and try and get the ghasts to go through it. The only problem is I'm not really sure where to build this. We're going to need to get a ghast in the first place, which as we saw in the previous video, wasn't as easy as we'd hoped. All right, let's eat a melon slice. Make sure we've got this down. I'm pretty sure I've eaten one of those before. I don't know if I've eaten raw beef. I feel like the raw stuff is the stuff that I haven't eaten yet. 33. Five to go. Oh, hello, fellas. How are you doing? Please be gone. Unless you're going to give me a skeleton head. Oh my goodness, you actually are. Hold up. It actually gave me one. <laughs> Hello. Well, that couldn't have gone better. Fantastic. Let's go find a ghast. The wither skull head, though, I will take that because I'm well up for getting another beacon soon. As long as I can get the wither skeletons to do it. Then I'll equal four. And I think we're going to need the beacons anyway for help with one of the last ones we're going to do, which is all of the potions effects at one time. Woo! Could have messed that up. But this is my uh, great selection of nether fortresses, which seems to be good for pretty much spawning anything you need in the nether. Cookies. Oh, I'm going to eat cookies. Cookies. Big noms. Yeah, that was another one as well. It actually was. I don't think I have anything else to eat at the moment. I've got distracted, but I will finish that off later. But yeah, this was the place where we found ourselves our ghast last time. We can also get wither skeletons here, all that good stuff. But we also need to build a ginormous nether portal. I'm going to try and build it in the ground because we need to try and pull it in. I think this is going to be fat enough. How fat is a ghast? A ghast is pretty fat. I'm going to need to be able to do this and just drag it in. I don't know how effective that's going to be, but we're going to give it a good go. Is that big enough? You think that's big enough? Oh, I hear a ghast too. I hear one. It's going to be annoying to take down if it isn't big enough, but I think this should be fine. This better work, by the way. I don't know where it's going to end up. I don't know if it's going to connect to my other end nether portal or not. Bam. Oh, look at this beauty. Absolutely amazing. We also need him to not attack it. Gusty boy, where are you? I need to whip you with my fishing rod. I think I hear two. There's one. Right, come over here. Did they both disappear? Don't do that to me. Don't spawn two in and then just both disappear. That's pretty harsh. Yep, both of these ghasts disappeared. Look at this. Ridiculous. I need to just pull it in there. And then when I get through, I also need to go through and bump it off and kill it. This also might be the last time we ever have to come to the nether, you know? I'm not sure, though. I'm not gonna... Ah! Get away from me! Stop! Stop in the name of... Let's shoot! Big bops. Come on, ghasties. You know you want to... You want to come to the overworld. You want to see what it's like. There's no other way to get a ghast in the overworld. You can't, like, manipulate spawns. You can't do anything like that. The achievement specifically states that you have to bring one back. So that's what we're going to try and do. I'm going to wait around for a ghast. And then we're going to try and get this bad boy through the giant nether portal. And in the meantime, I might... Oh, no! Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm in big trouble. I'm in big trouble. I should not have done that. Oh, no. Right, okay. It's going down right now. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. You're making me do this. It wasn't me. I was trying to shoot a ghast. Not even a ghast. A blaze. Guys, chill. Please chill. Where did a zombie come from? Did he come through the portal? Is that what's happening here? What are you doing here? You're not even supposed to be here. <laughs> Leave. You're making things worse. Oh, no. Right, I'm going to wait for that to wear off. Wait for a ghast and then try to get through the portal. Guys, please don't hate me. It wasn't me. I know you're all looking for me. Are you still angry? Hugs? Can we have hugs? We can have hugs. Okay, we're good. Never mind. Ah, this guy's angry. Why are you angry? Why is no one else angry? You're going to get me in trouble. Stop. Get away from me, you little punk. Why are there so many more spawning? Are they all like this? Does that mean they're angry at me? Oh, yeah, that's what that means. Why are they all mad? I didn't do anything to you. Oh, no, this could be it. This could be the end. I'm in big trouble here, guys. Oh, jeez. As long as they don't start attacking me from the back, I think I'm okay. They've got gold swords, remember? Oh, jeez. Stop, lads. I didn't mean it. Oh, it's a massacre. An absolute massacre. All I wanted was the ghasts. 
Is, is it because they're jealous that I'm taking the ghast home and not them? It could be it. I think if they've got their arms up, they're the ones that want to attack me. So I think I'm safe for now. Quite scary when that happens. Very scary. I hear ghast noises. But these pigmen are still really mad at me. Ow! Oh, why? He's right there as well. This is actually good. Ghastly boy, come and see the angry pigmen. Look, come over here. This is perfect. Buddy, what's good? What's good? I'm going to bring you over. Come here. I need to hook you. Oh, it's like he wants to come in. No! Oh, no, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. Oh, no. Oh, no. I need to get over here so quickly. Come on. Why didn't I think of this? Oh, jeez. I have my Elytra on me. Right, I'm going to Elytra real fast. Right, let's do this. This. Oh, no. Oh! Oh! I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. My life just flashed before my eyes. Oh, my goodness. Quick, eat something. Eat something real fast. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. My heart. Oh, oh, I almost died. That was almost it. I fell off the edge just trying to get a ghast into a thing. Please calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Stop burning. It's okay. Oh my goodness. How did I think that quickly? The Elytra just saved my life. Is this guy mad at me? Are you good, bro? Oh my goodness. I don't even know where I've gone. I'm way out. Oh, that was terrifying. That was almost it. If I didn't have my totem, I'd be dead. I need to be super careful. Okay, um, can you imagine we're this close? Literally like three achievements away, maybe a little bit more, but you know what I mean? Single digits away from completing Minecraft and I almost died. That would have been tragic. I'm actually like kind of shaking, low key. That's the one thing that can really mess me over is that happening. Me falling into lava and not having a way out. Luckily, I had me a way out. Are you guys, are you guys okay now? Have I got my comeuppance for the whole outrage thing earlier? Are you sure? Woo! Okay, now that's over. I, I really didn't know what to say there, buddy. <laughs> this is dangerous. All I, That was perfect as well. That was the perfect ghast. And now I've lost him. Where is he at? They all came to follow me and attack me. Oh, man. Is there a chance that the ghast just went through by itself? Should we actually go through here and see what happens? I'm kind of curious. If the ghast went here by itself, that would be perfect. The ghast is not here by itself. Uh, have I got my map on me? Where am I? Okay, I'm way off. How did I get this far away? Wait a second. How is a ghast going to fit through here? I'm so confused. I'm just going to patch this up real quick. I almost died. Oh, I'm actually so glad that, that didn't happen. Can you imagine? We die now? You know what? It's fine. It didn't happen. I had to use a totem. No totem. I'd have been completely gone. I'd have been a goner. Oh, why? Right, I'm just going to fill this whole thing in so that I don't try and uh, kill myself again. And then we'll get back to the plan. Okay, I think this whole section is now very secure. Um, oh, that ghast got away from me too. I don't know where the other two came from, but they were aggressing on me when I was in my worst time. That's not nice. At least these guys aren't mad at me anymore. Oh my goodness. I actually can't get over how I've done that. I've managed to survive doing that throughout the whole let's play. I haven't done it once. And the time I choose to do it is when we're almost near the end game. That would have been so upsetting. Give me a skull. Give me a skull. I'm so angry. Okay, no skull. That's fine. I'll just throw your pity treasure off the edge. Oh, there's a ghast right here. That's perfect. Do not hit my nether portal. Why am I on fire? So many questions. Right then, lucky boy. You know what to do, buddy. This is playing with fire, though. Hey, buddy. Can you come here, please? Can I fish a ghast? Come on, that was close. Come here. Come here right now. Oh, I got him. Let's go. Come over here. Does this work? It's still attached. Bro, come over here. You can do it. Okay, it broke. <laughs> Ghastly poo, where are you? It's annoying that this is like a shelf because I made it into one. Where did it go? I think it's underneath. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's stuck in there, isn't it? It's stuck in the lava. Come to me, I need your assistance, please. Oh, there's one here. This is perfect. So perfect, come here. Come here right now. Come into the nether portal. Come here. He just broke my nether portal. Oh, it sounded like it anyway. Come here. Oh, why are you going so far away? It sounded like you broke it, but you didn't. Why are you running away? You scared? You scared? You actually scared? Oh, there's so much nonsense over here. I hate the nether. I hate it so much. Oh, man. Come get me, bro. Come get me. There's fire everywhere. Will it follow me this way? It was so close before. And then it blew it up. I don't think I can get the fishing rod that far. <laughs> it's going to be way harder than I thought. Come here. If you're going to aggress on me, 
Help me out. It disappeared, didn't it? <laughs> it's gone. We just need to wait for the perfect gas to spawn. And I don't think that's going to happen. So I think what happened here is it blew up the nether portal and made it like be destroyed. And then it relit it with its own fire. I'm pretty sure that's what happened because you saw it smash. You heard it smash. And then it just didn't smash. If that even makes sense. For this, my friends, this is going to be tough. Like really tough. What are you doing? Actually, I don't mind. Give me a skull. Blue Jake 3! Oh. oh, she worked. Are you kidding me? What? I got two skulls in like 10 minutes. There's one right here. There's a ghast right here. My luck. Ghasty, come here, buddy. Now he's destroyed. Oh, no, he's lit it again. Buddy, come here. I need you. Just come this way. I'm pretty sure he's lighting it again with the fire. Come here. Why did they all go away from me? He was so close. He spawned literally on the platform. Come here, you. I'm gonna have to try and get him to come further than the platform and then just get him to back up into it. I can't even shoot it because my bow is too powerful. I think he's gone underneath as well. What are you doing to me? How are we gonna get these in? They always run away. They're like deflecting my armor, like magnets. What's the word when they're not attracting? As soon as it sees me, it floats away. Come on there, buddy. Hello, how are you? You're not even gonna pay any attention to me. Okay, never mind. Do you wanna come for a once in a lifetime trip? Quite literally. Hold on. Oh, uh, oh, they actually repel. Ow! If you hit me, you're gonna get thorns, buddy. Oh my goodness, this guy is terrifying. He's actually really mad. When they notice you, they back up. This is gonna be like three times as hard as I thought it was gonna be. Come over here. Follow me. Follow me. Oh, don't even butt in. Come on, there's so much danger around here. Why would you wanna be here? They're literally trying to explode us. <laughs> you're annoying. You're so annoying. And he's despawned. He's gone. Great. I think I might have to take a more crazy approach to this. What I might have to do is go all Elytra on this. I actually might have to. To get an Elytra, fly over to a Ghast, let it hit me, but at least I can, like, uh, lucky boy it towards me. I can fish it. Because otherwise, they're just going to keep retreating, and I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not sure how else I can achieve this. Should we just do it? Let's just try it. Let's go. Otherwise, it's going to be, you know what, it's not even worth. Is it worth doing this? I guess it is. We should be able to find our way home. Oh, great. It's nighttime. What are you doing here, sir? Let's go. We shouldn't be too far away. Oh, I need to note down the coordinates. I'm out of here. Ow. <laughs> that could have killed me, like, instantly. I think things are out to get me today. Like, definitely. Guys, I didn't even say goodbye to you. I could have died. All of you. Listen to me. I could have died. It was tragic. That was actually the scariest moment of the whole Let's Play. And we're on episode 50 today. Let's go. Episode 50 could have been the last one. <laughs> I wanted it to be the last one for other reasons, but I don't think that's going to happen. We did get, though, two Wither Skulls, which is actually pretty amazing. Guys, I'm out of here. I'm not going to say goodbye to you because I'm not going to let that happen again. That was ridiculous. Oh, wait. I need a totem. Oh, man. Things could have gone way worse, so I definitely need one of those by my side at all times. Just think, if we weren't using totems for whatever reason, the let's play would have been over. It would have been fully over twice, actually, now. <laughs> now I'm out of here. Oh, I found it. I actually found it. But you know what I didn't think about? Are these going to break? I should have mended them before coming out here. So what I might have to do is slay a load of pigmen again just to get the experience. Whew. Okay, I'm back to the danger hole. What's good? There's a ghast right there. See, I can't fly around now. Even though I've been back to get the stuff to fly around, I can't do that until I've repaired these. That's so annoying. Oh my goodness. I just got another wither skeleton head. That is insane. How did I get so many? Oh no, this guy just this guy just messed up. <laughs> you just see one of the pigmen and they got mad. That's insane. Why are you it wasn't me! Wait, if the skeleton does it, I get the blame? Oh, man. Okay, right then. Okay, I see how it is. I'm just gonna have to take you guys out then, huh? That's what's gonna have to happen. And it's lagging too. That's great. Today is the day that I die. I think this is the day that I die, guys. I'm, it's out. It's, I'm done. Hold on a second. I think I just made all of those pigmen go through the portal. <laughs> I think that's what happened. They're all gone. I think they just went through the portal. That's actually amazing. Go through. He's gone. Oh, this is great. So if they get angry, I just need to get them to go in there. Okay, fine. But that means there's going to be plenty of angry pigmen on the other side when we take the gas through. Did I just get another? I did. That means we can summon the wither again. And the way I want to do this is there's another way to like automatically kill 
the wither. And it's by using the end, I'm pretty sure. And it's the same technique where you can suffocate it. But I don't think it needs any kind of interaction from you. So I don't need to push it into the ceiling. This is trickier than I thought it was going to be. I thought I'd be able to just whip a fishing rod straight into the gas and then it'd be fine. But apparently not. And if the skeleton shoots the zombie pig man, apparently that's my fault. Insane. Ow! What? No! You can't just choose to attack me for no reason. What is going on today? Dude! Watch this. Look, if I get these guys to aggress on me and then try and get them to chase me through the portal, they just go straight through. They can't run through it for some reason. There's going to be so many pigmen on the other side. It is unreal. Go on, get out of here. Be gone. They can't walk through nether portals. That's crazy. Oh, never mind. This one can. Never mind. Okay, welcome to day two of this ghast hunt. That's right, it's taken me another day to try and do this. Please don't attack me. Please don't attack me. I come in peace. It's been a whole day. You must have forgotten about it by now. Jeez. Right, updates. I've made this a little bit bigger because I feel like these fat boys... Okay. <laughs> He disappeared. I feel like the fat boys need a bigger portal to go through. So, um, I can hear a gas. Oh, it's over there. I'm going to see if I can just try and snag one. I need to be careful because I really don't want to fall down again. I'm almost over the fact that I lost almost everything, pretty much everything in the last half. The problem with these ghasts is that they just avoid my, um, oh, wait, hold on. This guy's, this guy's up for it. Get him. Get this man. I want to hook him. I don't want to get distracted, though, because they just, like, repel you for some reason. They don't come towards you. They just kind of... Wait, I just <laughs> hooked that fireball. That was amazing. But yeah, they, they repel you. So it's super hard to get them hooked onto the flat. Oh, my goodness. That was close. It's so hard to get them hooked onto the fishing rod. And that's my only way to get them in. These blazes are annoying as well. But now I just need to wait and get super aggressive with the fishing rod. Like really aggressive. Because I just need to reel them in. I also need to make sure that he stays inside this portal for long enough. Oh wait, this is perfect. Oh my goodness. Please don't blame me for that, pig man. I know you've been pretty aggressive. No, come here. I don't want to hook that. <laughs> oh no. It's because they go up. He was so close to. Bat it away. Bat it away. Oh no. This is tragic. At least we know the gas spawn here. That's perfect. But trying to hook them onto a, a fishing rod is ridiculous. It doesn't really go that high in the air, does it? I can't even get it. It's impossible. Oh my goodness, he's here. He's here. Why are you here? Come here. Oh no, I'm on fire. This is so tragic and so difficult. This has to be one of the most difficult ones, surely. Uh-oh. Yeah, I just killed it. I, I didn't mean to do that. Um. <laughs> Wait, he's coming. He's coming over and he hasn't seen me yet. Could this be time to grab one? I just can't fling my fishing rod high enough. Cunning plan number three. All right, I'm going to try and repair my elytra by mining up quartz, only wearing the elytra. So I am risking it right now. I'm bearing it all and hoping that I don't get attacked by something. Because if I do, I'm in big trouble. Whoa, okay. There is one coming at me right now. I need to be careful. This guy, while I was repairing my elytra. Oh, I couldn't hook him. Come down here. Get out of the... I don't know what's going on. I think he's just trying to break my thing up here. Oh, wait. I've got him. Oh! Come here. Come here. Don't kill me, bro. Don't kill me. Oh, I hooked him as well. You little punk. Oh, I think he broke it again. All right, I need to take this off and put this on. Oh, I actually hooked him. It drags them really far. Come here. Come here right now. I need to not lose this. This is the best guard so far. No, I dragged the ball. I keep on dragging the flame charge. This is ridiculous and it's getting real dangerous. I'm scared. I'm scared. All I was doing was mining quartz and the perfect ghast comes at me. That guy was a terror. An absolute terror. What on earth? I whipped him so close. I have to cover up these holes. Otherwise, there is potential that I almost die again, which I don't want. Look at this. Danger. Oh, man, that was so close. That's the closest we've had so far. But if I do hook the ghast, those things properly pop towards you when you bring in the, the fishing rod. So as long as I can get one lucky reel, which also almost happened then, I think we're on to a winner, guys. Yeah, I thought finding one of every food was pretty difficult, but uh, the ghast is teaching me otherwise. What is even happening? Oh, it's you, the other side of the portal. That's not even fair. Get out of here. Next competitor, right here. This could be it. If I can land a fishing rod. Oh, that was close. If I can land a fishing rod on this bad boy, this could be my one. I can't get it 
up there, though. He keeps flying to the surface. Do I need to do this closer to the surface? And now he's gone. They just randomly disappear out of nowhere. This is so horrible. In other news, I got my wings almost up to full, which is great news. That means I can actually fly home or fly around and get some gas. But I don't know how I'm going to do it. Flying and operating a fishing rod ain't going to be my strongest thing, is it? Just like that, fully repaired wings. That's what I'm talking about. Quartz is so good for mending. It's unreal. I just paused my game. This ghast just spawned in the perfect location. But I don't know if I'm going to be able to hook it. I'm going to hook it. Ah! Oh, I almost died. I almost died again. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's get let's get up there. Let's get up there. Let's not mess around. I can't believe I just did that. I hooked it perfectly. And now he's in the ceiling. Ah! I think they get stuck in these lava bits and die sometimes. Right, you. You're coming with me, buster. Can I hook him from here? I don't know how far this goes. I feel I feel like it goes far, but it actually doesn't. Hook him. Hook him. Hook him. Hook him. I've got him. I've got him. Come with me, buddy. Come with me. I've got another one. Let's go. I just have to chain it. Come on, then. This is it. This is it. As long as he doesn't come off. This is it. Come on. Come on. Through the portal. Let's go. Through the portal. Get through the portal quick. Yes. <laughs> He went through. Oh, I'm so pleased. He just went through. So, unfortunately, we can't keep him alive. This man has to die. Le Chute, you need to do this, buddy. This is going to be beautiful. Here we go. Through the portal and the gas should be waiting for us. Possibly with loads of other crazy mobs. Depending what time of day it is. Where is he? I hear him. Oh, look at all the pigmen. Look at all the pigmen. Where is the gas? There he is. Get him. Get him. Look at this. A gas in the overworld. Let's. Go! Oh, we did it. I can't believe these are all the guys that were mad at me before. Look at this. This is so weird. Dude, that was difficult. So difficult. Rescue a gosh from the nether, bring him safely to the overworld, then kill it. Guys, we did it. And now, now you're all here doing things. Just stuff and stuff and things. Oh, that's so beautiful. I'm so glad I just got that. You have no idea. How do we get home? Let's put rockets in our off hand. Oh, I did it. And I almost died in the process. Was it worth it? I'm not really sure. But you know what? We got the achievement. My goodness, that was difficult. So that's the strat, though. You got to wait for a gas to spawn in, like, on the surface, I guess. And then you just got to get lucky. That's the first bit of lucky. Then you just need to chain fishing rod him. Because they go really far on the fishing rod. Like, seriously far. So that's how you do that. That must be quite a new achievement. Because you never used to be able to make nether portals that were bigger than the standard size. Obviously, a ghast won't fit through it. That took some blood, sweat, and tears. That almost died by falling in the nether lava. That's probably one of the only ways I was sure fire going to die. Because I'm pretty much immune to everything else. And it almost happened Turns out I'm immune to that too, thanks to the Elytra. Thank goodness for the Elytra. Wow. But I'm so glad that I'm alive. I can still wear my Peppa Pig shirt with pride. And we're a couple more achievements closer to being able to complete the game. I don't know what to say. We're so, so close. This took me a while to do, but it just needed that one lucky gas spawn. And we've made it home. At least we have that now as well. So if I want to go straight to a nether fortress, I know exactly where to go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Careful now. Careful now. Let's not get too crazy. And land. Beautiful. I made it, guys. I made it. You have no idea where I've been, but I made it. Unnamed Doggo. I still don't have a name tag for you. Oh, I need to show you something. It's pretty embarrassing, actually. So I went in here to see if I just had a name tag lying around and I forgot about it. Look at this book. It has piercing three. <laughs> piercing three. That is what we tried to find last time through the villagers. Luckily, the villagers didn't take long, but my goodness, that's embarrassing, isn't it? It was already there the whole time. <laughs> Oh, never mind. Never mind. Mistakes were made. Right, let me put all this stuff back, and then we'll see if we've got some time for a couple extra bits today. Three Wither Skulls. Still got some obsidian left over as well. Today is a great day. A fantastic day. Progress has been made, my friends. Is that a complete page? Almost here. Ah, oh, every potion effect applied at the same time. That's going to be hard. The end is done. Habit husbandry is almost done. Minecraft is done. We only need four more of these. So if we can figure out which these are, we might as well just clean that up today as well. Oh, you know what we do need to eat? 
a poisonous potato. Now, a poisonous potato is really hard to get a hold of. You either get it from killing zombies or has a 2% chance of dropping one from potatoes. That's insane, right? These are potatoes, I believe. So let's try and get a poisonous one, shall we? 2% chance. If we mine up 100 of these, odds are we get one. I've just found one. <laughs> Wow, okay. Didn't realize it was going to be that quick. We found a poisonous potato, my friends, and we are going to eat it. I saw it. There it is. Poisonous potato. Disgusting. It looks absolutely disgusting. I'm going to eat it. I don't know what happens. I hope I don't die or something. Here we go. Let's eat the potato. Oh, we appear to have survived. Are we one of the lucky ones? Are we blessed? I think we're blessed. That should definitely be another one. Right, three to go. What are they? I think it might be... Raw mutton, but I don't think we have any raw foods left. We've done the, all the weird ones, I think, and all the negative ones. I'm pretty sure we've done all those. I've only got cooked mutton here. We've done raw rabbit, raw salmon, potatoes, Did I eat eggs for something as well. Sheep, I need you. I know there's some over here somewhere. There's one. Come here. I need you. I need your foods. Sorry, friends. So sorry. How did you survive one of my slashes? You're insane, buddy. Let's try this. Let's eat the raw mutton. We're up to 36. There's two left. It must be the raw ones. Raw salmon. We've definitely done raw salmon, right? That was today. Or in this episode, anyway. Raw chicken? I know where to find me some chicken. But I think I've already eaten one. So I think one of the things we need to do is craft an enchanted golden apple, which is gold blocks, I think. So I need to get me some more gold. I don't think we're going to be able to do this. I need eight times nine. That's like quick maths, quick maths, 81. I need 81 gold to be able to do this. So I might actually have to leave this for next time because I think you have to eat one of those. Or did they take them out? I'm not sure. I think it may be raw pork chop. I need your services, piggy poop. Here we go. Right, raw pork chop. Come on. 37 it was as well. Right, I think the last one that I need is the enchanted golden apple, which is going to need a ridiculous amount of gold. Can I get inside my house? Ouch. That's fine. Oh, no. Guys, I've just read up what happens with the enchanted apple. You used to be able to craft them in survival mode. But now you can only craft these bad boys, which are the normal golden apples. This is how you make a normal golden apple. It's make an enchanted one, replace all the gold ingots with golden blocks, and you could craft one. However, now you cannot do that. What does that mean? It's going to take ages to be able to find one because the only place you can find them are in dungeons. That's right. That's the only place you can find them. And they're a really low percentage as well. So that's a mean one, a real mean one to get. But you know what? We're going to find it. Not today, but we will find it. We've only got one left to do. We only have five left, five achievements left. And we have completed Minecraft without dying, even though that almost happened today. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you are excited for the rest of the episodes and you enjoyed this one, please do leave a like. That'd be greatly appreciated. And if you feel like subscribing, you've enjoyed your time here today, then please do consider hitting that subscribe button that's just below the video, the big red button. That'd be greatly appreciated. Apart from that, thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll see you soon. Goodbye. Swing wagon, candle, canvas, sofa, fork, rubber band.